Hello and welcome to the Quick Start Opening Balances Accounts Receivable video tutorial for EasyLaw. Accounts receivable are unpaid bills on your clients. During a data conversion, it is important to ensure that accounts receivable recorded up to the conversion date that have not yet been paid are brought forward into EasyLaw so that they can receive payments in the future. If you do not record accounts receivable, you can proceed to the Quick Start Opening Balances Work in Progress Fees video tutorial. Accounts receivable entries can be entered in a few different ways. If a client has multiple outstanding accounts receivable, each account can be entered separately using the conversion date and the invoice or reference number. You can also enter the total fees disbursements and taxes for a client with multiple outstanding accounts as just one account. Only you can decide which method is best for your firm. I do recommend that you enter the breakdown for fees, disbursements and taxes so that in the event that an account needs to be written off in the future, the program will accurately calculate the tax write-off. Click the down arrow beside the Create Bills followed by enter slash modify bills to proceed. Enter the client or press F5 to display a list to choose from. Enter the date of your conversion or if you are entering accounts receivable in detail enter the date of the receivable entry. Please note detailed receivables can still all be entered as of your conversion date for speed of data entry. Enter a bill number. The description will display automatically as account rendered. You can edit this if you choose. Enter the fees, disbursements and taxes if applicable. Click Save or press Enter on the Save. Billed fees must be distributed to the correct lawyer. Type A to distribute the fees to the responsible lawyer. Type P to prorate the fees based on the time on the file. This will not apply for conversions. Or type M to allocate the fees manually. Continue entering transactions until the total receivables on the bottom right of the screen is equal to the total receivables being entered in your data conversion. You can exit without posting if necessary and continue entering transactions later and you can also post the transactions that you have entered in batches. Just make sure that the total of all of your batches is equal to the total receivables you need to enter for your conversion. I will talk about reports in later video tutorials that can assist you with retrieving this information. Click Post to finish. If you wish to continue with the Quick Start setup of EasyLaw, please select the Quick Start Opening Balances Work in Progress Fees video tutorial next.